Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a collective haul of just things that I got over the past few weeks. It's gonna be like some fashion stuff, jewelry, Kate Beauty. So let's get started. So first I'm gonna start with the accessories. Um, the accessories that I'm wearing right now. I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys have been looking at this um, when I started this video. So this necklace is my current favorite. If you guys follow me on Instagram, I wear this all the time. It's my favorite. Um, so these are from Ana Luisa. You guys know Ana Luisa is my favorite, favorite accessory brand. So um, I got this heart charm necklace and this silver earring. And this necklace actually, it comes as a set with this. So you could just wear it alone or you could wear this together like so. And this necklace is cute too if you just wear it alone. All my friends have been like asking me, where did you get your necklace? It's so pretty. So yes, Ana Luisa. I mentioned this so many times, but their quality is so good. Like. The colors don't change at all like all my pieces that I got like three four years ago is still in great condition it has in like rusted or changed colors hard charm necklace and then this one is a little thicker it's like a chain um, it's so lightweight Look at these hoop earrings earrings are also very lightweight I don't like wearing jewelry that is heavy Especially earrings. I actually got the same set but in gold. That's how much I love this design. So when I wear a lot of blacks, I like to pair it with silver. And then when I wear like lighter colors like white or beige color outfits, I like to wear gold. The exact same design, same chain, um, the set of two but in gold. I have a feeling these will be sold out really quick. So go grab it if you guys want it i will link the item links down in the video info box and i also got these cute hoop earrings so it's like a hoop in a hoop so these are the ashley earrings and these are also very very lightweight so pretty these you can actually take the bottom one out and just wear this alone by itself like so just make sure you don't lose this piece and the last pair are these long dangly earrings so pretty i was looking for something a little bit more um fancy because when i went to la last month i wanted something like this to wear with my um, solid black dress for dinner so these were perfect my outfit looks so good with these earrings and these are also very lightweight. Um, upload a picture here of me wearing the dress and these earrings. Those are some of my recent new accessories. I will link everything down below. And also, I love how Ana Luisa like comes with this pouch for every single piece that she purchase. K Beauty, I have a few products on um, like Korean skincare. Ta -da! So this is the Abibu, Abibu Gummy Sheet Mask Heart Leaf Sticker. So I actually have a lot more. I have like, like two times more than this downstairs. But I just like grabbed some to show you guys on this video. Yes, this is the exact same thing. If I like a product, I just like stock up on that same product. So when I was in New York um, last month, I went with my makeup artist friend Jessica and on the last day in New York, she did my makeup for me. And before she did my makeup, she put on this mask um, on my face. She's like, Omni, your face is so dry. Like you need to put this mask on. It's gonna look so different. Like your makeup's gonna look so good because yesterday your face looked really dry and um, dull. So um, I just put this on for like maybe five minutes because we were late that day to my event that I was supposed to be at. She left the mask on my face for about five minutes. She took it off, um, waited for it to kind of dry off, and then she put my foundation on top, and I was like, wow, my foundation look, looks so good. I couldn't believe it was the same foundation that I used the day before. Um, that's how much of a difference a mask can um, make. 
So if you guys watch my vlogs, I think I've mentioned these brow products before. They are amazing. This is from Hakite and this is from Espoir. So I've been using both eyebrow pencils on my brows every day. So this is good because it's very light. Like it just makes your brows look very natural. This is perfect for like the front part of your eyebrow because you don't want it to be too harsh and dark. So um, with this, I fill in the front of my eyebrows and then the ends. Um, it doesn't really draw that well on the ends because it's so light. I'm very oily, especially around my eyebrow area. So some eyebrow pencils, it doesn't like draw or it just like comes off right away. So I mix it together. This one it has like a very tiny triangle shape. The Hakitu one also has the same shape. It's like so highly recommend these. My friend Jessica, when we went to New York, she did have like a travel size of this shampoo, the Labo H Hair Loss Relief Shampoo, Scalp Strengthening. So I tried it when I was in New York and I loved it. So um, I did order a lot. There was actually like a set of five in Korea. So I bought the set of five. This helps with hair loss and helps um, keep your scalp strong because you need a healthy scalp for you to not lose any hair. This has been working great for us so far, for me and Aiden. And um, I love it because when I wash my hair, it has this like cooling effect, like a mint type of, yeah. So I love it. I did also get three of my favorite hair tonics. Do you guys remember I used this all the time when I was in Korea? This is the um, Dr. For Hair, right? Yes, Dr. For Hair Folligen, Folligen? Um, hair tonic. And this was my favorite. Like, I think I used this the last two years I was in Korea. And since Olive Young was like right down the street, I just picked it up anytime I ran out. But here, I noticed they don't sell this on Amazon. They sell the Dr. Four Hair Shampoo, but I couldn't find the tonic. So my friend that went to Korea, she... Oh, no, no. This one I actually ordered online um, from this app called Brinko. So I ordered three of this. Whenever my hair feels like itchy and stuff, I just spray this on my hair. I do spray this on my hair whenever I get out of the shower. Like as soon as I wash my hair, I spray this. Kind of like... I use it kind of as like a moisturizer for your scalp because your scalp is also skin and when I get out of the shower, I have to put on lotion as soon as I get out. If I wait a few minutes, it's going to start like getting really dry and rough. So as soon as I get out of the shower, I put on my lotion, quickly put on my lotion all over my body. I spray this on my scalp and then I dry my hair. And lately I've been drying my hair with like low heat and cold air instead of like warm hot air. I've noticed that that also helps with my scalp. Like that, you could just spray it on or what I do is I just like spray it on my palms like this, rub it and just like massage my scalp. That's it. Okay, the next two products is not a K-Beauty product. Um, this one is the Charlotte Tilbury powder, setting powder. And this is in the shade number one, Fair. My friend Jessica, when we were in New York, she also set um, my foundation using her Charlotte Tilbury setting powder. And I haven't used powder to set my face for so long. And I totally forgot about how much difference it makes when you set your foundation. Um, with the powder, it just makes it like long lasting without looking cakey or um, dry. So she used this on my face. I loved it. I went to Sephora last week and the original size, I think it's like 50 something dollars with tax. But I was like, oh, I don't know if I'm gonna just end up using it a few times and then like stop using it. So just in case, I just got a small set. They actually had the small set at like the front of the register. You know how they all have that like mini bar, like a mini section where they sell all the travel size stuff. So they actually had the mini size of this. And this was like $25. So half the price. I set my foundation with this. Today, um, my face looked flawless. Like kind of like an airbrushed look. 
and it hides all my pores like i see a huge difference when i set my foundation don't set my foundation with this powder very very soft powder yeah i just use like a small powder brush and just like put it on my face for fashion of course my favorite place zara i got a couple things from there so this dress is a very pretty like um, simple dress it's a um, princess cut at the top and it's a long dress it's a long dress it comes down to almost my ankles i been wanting this dress for the longest time but then was always always sold out and I've been checking every single day and finally one small was back in stock so I purchased it right away okay so this is how the dress looks there is a slit in the back I love this princess cut sweat shirt sweatpants set whenever i wear this set out a lot of people ask me like where did you get your um outfit from i love it so i was like zara so this one and at the waist and then there's a tie i got it in small size small inside it's fleece it's so soft and kind of thick perfect for the upcoming winter time the sweatshirt is just plain sweatshirt so i actually got this in a size medium because i like to wear the top part like sweatshirts kind of oversized fit so instead of small i got it in a medium good material so warm and cozy and soft sweatpants are also from Zara. I've been wearing these non-stop um, whenever I go out, whenever I go to the airport, rubber band waist, and then these are also wide. This pants is thinner than the other ones because the other one was like a fleece type inside, but then this is just like a regular sweatpants. These cargo pants you guys know like cargo pants are back in trend right now and i've been looking for like a specific look like a specific cargo pants and i found it at zara and i liked it so much that i got it in two different colors so i got it in this like light tan color and then this blue navy our straight leg i like to wear it um kind of like a baggy fit i wore both of these to new york so comfortable i love it Compare this with like any top, t-shirts, tanks, and it looks really good. Last, I have this leather, like a thin jacket. So my friend Jessica, I've talked about Jessica so many times in this video, you guys should meet her she's so sweet and she's actually a makeup artist she works with um aiden because she does wedding makeup and then you guys know aiden does wedding photography so they work together a lot um anyways so when we went to new york she had this jacket brought this jacket with her and she was like man so i got this jacket from aritzia and it was just too late to return it um, because she was I guess deciding if she should return it or not and then the return date passed and so she was saying that it doesn't look good on her so she told me to try it on and when I tried it on I, I fell in love with it and then even Jessica was like oh my gosh it looks so good on you so she was like only just keep it I was like no because I know how expensive Aritzia is and especially for something like this I sure it was gonna be like over $200 later we ended up um, agreeing to just paying half so i paid half um to her so i bought this used from jessica thank you hey guys so that was all for this collective haul i will try to list most of the items that i showed you guys today like the analogs accessories and the k beauty products down in the video info box so check it out hope you guys have a great start of the week and i'll talk to you guys on my next video bye